uh, Sergeant English Thomas, T H O M A S English E N G L I S H. MLS is 2336 EOD technician. Okay, yeah, so today we just uh, went out there and uh, did some operational area clearance. Uh, basically, we just go out there and check the, uh, look around for any unexploded ordnance. And uh, when we find something, uh, blow it up. Uh, it's generally just used to dispose of and destroy stuff by detonation, um, but mainly just to clear saturation levels of UXO on ranges uh, so people can still use these ranges without it being too oversaturated with UXO. Uh, so as a whole we're a response force. Uh, we respond to uh, any UXO threats, uh, weapons of mass destruction, IEDs, uh, basically anything with uh, explosives. Uh, we respond to that whether CONUS or OCONUS and uh, it's, you know whether we're out here training or uh, overseas deployed forward and uh, supporting anyone with, with route clearance or anything like that. Uh, so for MRF-D, we're more here for a training support. Uh, training and support, uh, like, asset. And the m most important thing that we're supposed to do out here is come out here and clean up these ranges for everyone, get rid of the UXO, and then just be a, a response force for anyone. Uh, while they're conducting any training, come across any dud fired, ordinance or any other unexploded ordinance that they find uh, while they're conducting training. Uh, so today we employed uh, just C4 uh, in order to dispose of by detonation uh, some UXO that we found out there. Uh, generally for that what we did today we just set up some uh, mainline branch lines. There's a technique we use to dispose of multiple ordinance uh, at once and uh, we, we did that uh, today with C4 and some deck cord. Uh, so in the event that something like that does occur uh, where we have to uh, pick up and, and, and patrol or uh, move forward, um, we have a pretty essential and, and unique piece of that as far as uh, what we bring to the table, whether it's uh, you know escorting people around and, and when they encounter UXO or, or any IEDs depending on the level of threat and, or the peer that we're going against. Um, we could clear that or also we bring uh, some new stuff to the table as far as like exploitation and how advanced we are getting with that. Uh, so if we do need to come across any uh, ordinance or, or anything like that, uh, we've had, we all had a pretty, pretty well, or we've all been pretty well trained at uh, how to exploit new stuff that's never been seen before, especially if it's peer to peer. Um, uh, so we'd be able to go in and, and uh, take that stuff apart and figure out what they're using to, to beat us basically. EOD is essential to MRFD. Yeah, so that's it. We, that's all we have for today. Uh, we're going to call the range cold, pack it up, get some sleep, get some chow, wake up tomorrow, uh, you know, start blowing some stuff up again.